Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants. Right here we try to help you decide if it's gonna change from a want to a need. Now we film live here with no edits. I prepare and do as much as I can ahead of time because as soon as I know something, I want you to know it too so that we can be in the know together. So if you're interested in informative videos, then make sure to press that subscribe button. It is free. You could ring that bell for a new video notification and don't forget to press that thumbs up. That will help this video to grow and hopefully find others who enjoy this type of content Content, they just haven't found true wants just yet but if you're looking just for a quick update then follow my Instagram my name there is true wants with the number two the link for that and any other links or discount codes that I have are always found in the description box right underneath this video but the most important thing that I want you to know about this channel is that we are a true community here at true wants we share solely about the brands the products, a course that deals with spoilers on subscription boxes too. And I always look forward to seeing you in the comments because that's your voice and I do my best to respond to all. As always, I appreciate when you can watch in full. And if you would like to contribute more to the channel, there's always the thanks button that you see right underneath this video. Okay, guys, we got this under the wire, which is just amazing. It is July 31st when this box arrived. And this is the PR unboxing for the month of August, which is the Ipsy Glam Bag, the BoxyCharm box, as well as the Icon box. As you know, or if you don't know, if you're not familiar with my channel, we do very informative videos here where we focus a lot on the products. That's why I choose to film this way. So the focus isn't on me. It is the focus is on the products and the deals that we're able to get through Ipsy. All right. We're going to every detail I'm going to share with you. I'm not going to go through anything quickly. I'm going to show you all the information, all the sneak peeks for September. All of that we're going to share in this video like as if you've gotten the PR box in person is how you should feel because you will be as educated as I can give you the information based on the actual products in person as opposed to all of the spoilers that we share on this channel because like you I am a paying customer I have two paid for accounts you'll have on my channel where you'll get to see in the month of August one of my accounts my original account I did have that upgraded to the icon box and my other account that got transferred over from my BoxyCharm, when BoxyCharm was purchased by Ipsy, it opened up a second account for me and I kept that. And it ended up being perfect for Icon Months. So in that account that I have, you'll see a glam bag, you'll also see a BoxyCharm box. So you'll see all of my paid versions. We'll also go through Choice Day, which I always share with you. I film choices before I even go to choose for myself. So like I said, if you're looking for an informative channel, then you 100% found it here. All right. But again, if you just want to see pictures, head over to my Instagram there. My name is Truance with the number two. So I'm going to do my best to show you everything up close. And like I said, at the end of the video, we'll go through the newspapers that have a little bit more information as well. Okay. There's a lot that is here. I've already taken my pictures for Instagram so that we can swatch and unbox and do all of that here. I've already removed any safety tags. So we'll be able to hopefully be able to see the, the textures and everything of the products up close. Because when it comes this, this before the first, which is when our choice day is going to be for the Icon and the Ipsy, but Ipsy has asked us in emails numerous times to only post in the month that it is. So I will be posting, as you see now, at midnight so that this way I stay within the what they're requesting us to do. And I like to follow the rules because I do enjoy having PR and I enjoy getting PR to the channel because like you, I'm a paying customer and it is more important to me that we have the time to go through all the products and not just show you what could possibly be in your box. All right, so here we have the glam bag, which this month I was ecstatic for. I think this is so on theme. They are so on the pulse of the trends. And I think this bag in particular tells you that 100%. Now, if you're not familiar, we're gonna start with the glam bag first, which is they promise us five deluxe sample sizes. It's $14 a month. It's $1.99 shipping. Um, they tell you it's free shipping. It's $1.99 for the, uh, they call it handling fee. And that is what we have for the cost of this. But as I mentioned, they say it's five deluxe sample sizes, but you and I both know that we get one choice item. And usually within the choice items, we do get a full size item as a choice, which is really fantastic for $14. Now the bag is always a bonus and it's always so inspirational that a lot of times when we're doing our choices, I love to know the inspiration behind it. And I always share that in my 
spoiler videos because like I said to you, I like information and that is why I have this channel is to share more information with you guys. So this here is says Glam on it. I think it is fantastic. It looks like like the, the old or maybe even it's now. I'm from Canada originally and I'm only here in the States full time for probably half a dozen years now full time. And we didn't have like varsity jackets and all of that. So when I see things like this, I get very excited. So this here, like I mentioned, is a bonus bag. It is a vinyl bag. It has this fantastic detail here with the Ipsy name solely being on the pull tag. When you open it up, it is fully lined in a really pretty yellow. So this I think is absolutely fantastic. This is stitched on. It is just really, really well made. And this, like I mentioned all the time, is the bonus item. So this is always very very exciting for me. I love being able to share about the glam bag because that is where it all started for me. All right. So starting with the first item that I pulled out of my glam bag is this one from Tony Moly. It is a pore tightening. They're saying this is going to be a mask and it says I'm a red wine and I'm going to do my best to bring everything up to the camera so you can see the instructions because we already did all of the spoiler videos in detail, not just pictures. We went through ingredients. We go through all the information that I can find so that, like I mentioned, you know, as a paying customer, I want to know as much as I can ahead of time. There's always some great surprises when we do our um, choices because there's a lot of items. They just give us a few sneak peeks and spoilers. So as I mentioned, I always do my best to remove any excess packaging, which this definitely had a safety seal but I always want to be able to open everything and swatch everything and smell everything so I can be able to share with you to the best of my ability on my first impressions. So this is what this item looks like here. So it looks like a clear consistency. It feels like a little bit of um, something that I think would definitely get a little bit tighter. It has a little bit more grip to it than I was anticipating, but we'll have to see. But like I mentioned, there is no scent to this that I can smell off the bat and this is Tony Moly and that is what the product will look like. The next item, and I do have a wet cloth and a dry cloth right beside me to be able to wipe everything down. The next item that was in here was one that we did not see in the spoilers that I, re re that I recall. I'm a little too excited. This is from Stone Street. This is Stone Street Soapbox is the actual name. I did receive in the past from BoxyCharm before they were part of Ipsy. A cream from this brand. So this is a brand that I'm a little bit familiar with, but not 100%. So if you are, that's where we come into being a community here, where if you've had the opportunity to try any of the products that we're going to be going through, I want you to definitely share it in the comments down below. So this they're saying is going to be a wholesome body souffle. And this one here is the information that is on the back of the tube. And like you, I'll be watching this, maybe not at midnight, because I'm going to try to schedule it. But I am going to be watching this to see back how good a job I did because I am definitely not tech no savvy, but I definitely want to make sure that I can do the best of my ability to get all the information that is on the back of the tube, which a lot of times it's the ingredients that are important for you guys to know, as well as where things are manufactured and things like that. So this again came with a safety seal that I already removed. We'll take a little bit on the back of the hand and we will do the smell test. So hopefully... This will have a bit of a scent to it because there's nothing better than a body lotion that has a scent. So that is what it looks like here. So it has a nice consistency to it. It's not too thick. It's not too thin. It has nice slip to it and it feels very moisturizing. So let's take a smell test. Yeah, it has a really nice scent to it. It is not overly flowery and it is definitely not. It just has a nice creamy type of um oh, the consistency of it is just stunning i will definitely put this all over and then i will show you one hand that has nothing and then the other one that has just been moisturized really really beautiful wow 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 okay impressed with that all right the next item that we got in here was something that i just started seeing because a lot of the large large influencers on other platforms were taken on a beautiful trip to greece by benefit and they were there to introduce this new line. And one of the products that they were introducing was this one. So this is amazing. And this is why I love Ipsy, is that they use Ipsy also as a vehicle. A lot of the good brands that we get in our boxes will take it. And even if it's in a sample size, we are now trying the latest launch 
in this box. And this is from Benefit. It's called the Pore Professional. It is going to be a matte primer. So I don't know much information about this because, like I said, you know, when the girls go on the trip, you see more about the trip than you do about the products. But it is what it is. So when this comes out and it is official, I'll be able to learn a little bit more. But hopefully we'll be able to see the consistency and some of the information. This is going to be really tough because it's so small. But when it is like this, as long as I stay in focus, we can always use our cameras or our phones to enlarge things to be able to read them a little bit better. So hopefully we'll be able to do that here. And then here is what is on the back. So again, this is their newest launch. So very excited about this. And this is the little tube that is in here to be able to try. And with primer, you really don't need that much. So this size tube, I think, will be enough for us when we're going to hopefully be able to do more this month than we did last month. The Get Ready's with me because I had so many spoiler videos between the Icon box and all the other boxes that I get, plus Fat Fit Fun. We uh, definitely did not have time to play as much as I would have liked to. So this is what this looks like here. And then we're just going to spread it out. So if you're not familiar with the benefits line, it was developed by two sisters. And then those two sisters ended up having daughters. And their daughters are the ones now that do a lot of the marketing on the products. They're the ones if this product is going to be like on the shopping channels. Those are the people that you normally see. So this just feels like it really mattified. It feels really nice like a lotion, but you can definitely feel the mattification. So that I'm really excited about because I am definitely a combo girl. So this is something that I'm going to definitely have the opportunity to use and enjoy. And I do like the benefit line. So that is one that is, if it was in, you know, the add-ons to try for $350, I definitely would have picked that up for myself. The next item that was in here is definitely a full size item because this is a sponge. And this one is, I'm going to show you the it in the carton and then I'm going to pull it out because this cute design is not on the sponge. It's only on the carton, but they do have where you can see it on the carton better with what through the plastic when the sponge is in there. It says that it's latex free and that it's super soft and it's from the brand, this is made in China, but this is from the brand that's called M2U NYC. So I did open it up from the bottom so that we can pull the actual sponge out and we can feel it. So as you can see here, the cute packaging has it that there. It would have been cute if it was on the sponge, but it's not. So this is what this looks like here. And this is the design of it, which is a fantastic one. If you're like me and I love beauty sponges, I love when it has a bit of a tip to it so we can get it into the corners. And I love the flat surface also. This has a really smooth consistency to it. I like ones that are a little bit, have a little bit more porous I guess would be the right word but this has more of like a silicone soft type of feel to it but as you know you always should wet these sponges damp and then squeeze out any excess assets this has some nice flexibility to it definitely will try it but uh like I said this is a full-size item in a $14 box which is always fun then my ended up with my two glam bags I ended up having a opportunity to have a, two choices because I have two glam bags that I pay for and one of them was this item here so when mine arrives I will definitely put that into my gifts for later this is from beauty vault this one is called the regal palette it comes in the box and then we opened up the box, which I will show you too, but they do have the ingredients on the outside of the box here, as well as the other information that is on the bottom here. And it shows you that it's made in the PRC. And then when you open it up, there's no mirror in here, but it, it the colors in here are just stunning. And I will definitely be swatching these so we can see what the consistency feels like on first impressions. It did come with a little uh, safety plastic in it but we will definitely do some swatches here. So I'm gonna swatch the three on the top and then I will do the three on the bottom. This is the first time that I'm trying this product's uh, eyeshadows, but I did have the opportunity to try this product in their lip products and I was impressed with those. So I already wiped everything off and the primer, it did not leave any sticky sensation to it. It just feels nice. So we're just going to put it right over it here. So this is the consistency of the products there. And there's still so much on my fingers. So the fact when these type of products are in the uh, glam bag, which I mentioned is $14, they have the opportunity to get 
actual eyeshadow palettes for six, whatever they want to send, you have the opportunity to actually try the products. And a lot of these are available on their sites that they sell them at full retail. So these aren't products that are made exclusively for our boxes or our bags. This is actual product of theirs. So this is always very exciting. So this one here, we're going to definitely the... Um, from my first impressions but definitely hopefully we'll have the opportunity to try this a little bit more i cannot believe how much is still left on my fingers this one here the swatching of the actual ones that have the satin shimmer to it went on so smooth it, it was like unbelievable but those are the shades and i think they are beautiful and they definitely scream fall so this is very exciting and one that i'm really looking forward to playing with so again newer to this brand when it comes to eyeshadows so if you had the opportunity make sure to share that in the comments down below so i'm just going to do my best to wipe off my hand which is going to be our palette for trying all the products on and then trying my best to get it off all my fingers. All right, the next that we're gonna go through is going to be the BoxyCharm box. And the BoxyCharm box is five full-size items. It costs $30. You also get that $1.99, but what is amazing about the BoxyCharm box is there's two things that are special about it. One is they choose two what they call power picks. And those power picks, they promise more than pays for the box. And then after that, you will get a selection of products in threes. So you'll be able to choose one item in each category that they send down, and then you'll get to complete your five full sizes. Three of them you get to choose, two of them they choose for us. And when we do the spoilers, we share what the power picks are going to be and all of that. So this is always exciting when this PR starts to arrive because we get to see a lot of the products that maybe we didn't even see in the spoilers. This one here is from Key Soul Care. This is a brand that I really was really impressed with. And I don't know if you guys got, there was another box company that also is no longer around that used to do where they would get a lot of products from one brand. And it was an amazing box that I really enjoyed enjoyed and it was really sad when because they kept saying they were going to come back they were just reorganizing and they never came back but they had a box that was filled with Keys products and Key Soul Care is a brand that is just amazing it is developed alongside Alicia Keys and a dermatologist and it started off really being a lot of skincare and now she's getting more into natural makeup so that is really exciting too. And we did some spoilers on some of the products that we're hopefully gonna see. So I'm really excited about that. And all of her packaging is really, really beautiful. And let me just pull this here because there should be some information on some of these cards that I'll go through with you at the end as well. So on this one here, this is what the product looks like. They come in these beautiful glass jars that are really, really high end, but they're really reasonably priced. She always has affirmations on her bottles also. This one says, I am stronger than I know, which is amazing. It also says it in French, which is fantastic. And then, like I mentioned, this is a glass bottle and her theme is always with these purple packaging. Some of her products had a lavenderish scent to it, but a lot of her products that I used afterwards, I did not, I found they, their, that scent wasn't in majority of her products. It was in a cleanser, I think, that I used. So this is what the consistency of the product looks like. I'll take a little bit on the back of this finger here so that we can just see. And I will definitely do the smell test. And this, I don't think, has any scent to it either. And we'll just close this up. And just drop it here for now. There's going to be a lot of products. I'm going to try to keep as much as I can on screen, but it will definitely be more products than what this camera will be able to see. So that is the consistency of the product here. We'll just put it on here. It's a moisturizer. It is very moisturizing. It is really, really beautiful. I'm gonna put it on this hand too because I definitely took out a little bit too much. So this is a brand, like I said, that I really enjoyed. I used every single product from the box that I got all the way to the end, which means that I was really, really enjoying the products. And uh, I, cause like you see, between all the products that I purchased for myself, between the add-ons and all the boxes that I pay for, and then of course, some of the brands that I accept PR from because I still accept PR from the brands that I'm very interested in. And if it is a box that I'm getting, I don't stop my, my membership because with PR, I think that is a bonus that a lot of times we'll get it ahead of time and we'll be able to share more products because that's what this channel is all about. It is about the products. 
So we have here, the next one is from another brand that I got introduced to also through a serum. And it could have been from BoxyCharm before BoxyCharm was part of Ipsy. So share with me if you have, because I think we did not see any spoilers on this brand in particular, and it's called Floor and B. And this is the Eyes Eyes Baby. It's an anti-aging uh, firming eye cream. So we'll do the, all the information on the back of the carton here. It's mentioning that it's cruelty-free, 100% vegan, all of that here. And there's the website of the brand. And then here is some information on the back here. And I think it's fantastic when the first ingredient that they're showing here is caffeine, because that definitely helps with some of the puffiness that I am starting to see as the aging process is creeping in. And then here, original ingredients for all skin types. So here's all the directions and all of that there. Now, when I do get my paid versions, I definitely have a lot more information on every single product, but because this came in on the last day of the month and I wanted to be able to film and take pictures and do all that so that we can get it up prior to our choices is when it makes it a little bit easier for all of us to have that uh, opportunity to see it in person and hopefully make the our choice is a little bit easier. So this is the consistency here. Again, I'll take a little bit on the back of my finger. We'll close this guy up. Again, I don't think there is any scent on this, which is always good when we're talking about eye creams. And then this is what it looks like here. And as they tell you all the time, what I have learned from an esthetician is always use your ring finger because it's supposed to be your weakest finger. You take a dollop, a small dollop, like a dime size amount, on your finger and then if you tap them together you should have equal amounts on both and then always put it on around your orbital bone try not to go as close to the eye if you stay around the orbital bone and then focus on the crow's feet and then whatever's left over you put on the 11 lines when you do that you'll see that it will migrate up but if you put it too close that's where a lot of us including me if I don't do it what I say um, then I end up getting a lot of tearing in my eyes. But this feels like it has a really nice consistency to it. it, has enough thickness that I don't think you have to worry that where you place it, I think it will be beneficial. But I also think this will be really nice under makeup as well. So that is what the consistency of the product looks like. And like I said, I don't think there is any scent. It just smells really, really clean. The next item that we got in here is from this brand called K Voss, and it is a lip potion. It's an overnight lip mask, and this has a tube inside that I took out that I will definitely be swatching as well. It says it has a sweet almond in here. It has olive oil, pomegranate, as well as pineapple. So hopefully we'll have a little bit of a scent on this one. And here are some of the ingredients. This side here, also made in China. And then here they're saying what it is. They're saying it's supposed to be non-sticky, just based on how I'm looking at it here with you guys. Because like I said, I don't pre anything. I just remove all of the packaging so that we're able then to, to look at these things together at the same time of my time restraints, trying to be able to do this and still <laughs> do what I'm supposed to do during the day. All right, here we go. And let's take a little bit on the back of the finger. And that is what the consistency is here. I'm not feeling that there's any strong sense on anything yet. And we'll do it on the back of this hand here. And so it has a bit of a color to it. It is thick because it's supposed to be worn at night like a lip mask. I will put a little bit on my lips here. Yeah, it's not a sticky formula at all. As you can see here, there's a little bit of stickiness, but it definitely feels like it will stay on the lips exactly where you put it, which is amazing at nighttime. And excited about that. I use lip masks all the time, and uh, it is something that I feel has made the biggest difference. When I wake up in the morning, my lips normally still have a lot of the product on it, and they feel very moisturized and really healthy. The next thing that we got in here is some makeup. So we have here this one that is the Mineral Baked Highlighter. And this is from the brand that we all love, which is Il Maquillage. This is also a very high-end brand. So this is always fantastic when we get these type of brands in our boxes as well. And then that is some of the information here. 
hoping the camera's picking everything up. Okay, and then when I open this up to take the picture, the reason I left it in the box, which normally I remove everything in the boxes, is because it would just be a dark hole. You wouldn't see the actual product here. But what was beautiful about this box, uh, this product, is that it was a really different packaging. As you can see, it's that dome shape. The only products that I have tried that have been baked are ones that I got introduced from the brand Laura Geller. And again, they always have this dome to it. And what I have learned by watching Laura Geller for many, many years on the channels, on the shopping channels, is that it is a cream that they bake on a terracotta uh, clay and then they bake it. So when you're putting this on, you're putting it on and it feels like a powder, but it has all the benefits of a cream. So definitely for maturing skin, this is absolutely a fantastic product and that looks stunning. But as you can see, it always keeps, it's it, like you never, it, it takes a long, long time to definitely go through any of these type of products. But I was so surprised that this actually, when I opened it up, that it came off. I haven't seen a product like that in years so that is really something and then here is if you want to know this is it is this is the name that they're calling it i think it says give me more and it's a mineral baked highlighter and if one of the drugstore brands uh milani also does baked products as well but i got introduced to and learned all about these baked products look at this from uh, Laura Geller, just stunning. They go on beautiful, they don't sink into the fine lines, these baked products, because like I said, it's a cream formula that goes on like a powder and it is just, just stunning. Look at that, stunning, stunning, stunning. Okay, then of course the palette. So as you know, when if you've watched any of my uh, videos, I was keeping my fingers crossed for the one that was from Ofra, just out of curiosity because it was an influencer who made the product. It was one of her products and I mentioned to you that that one did so well that they ended up in Ulta. So that is gonna be hopefully available. I think it was a power pick. It is the one from Ofra. It had a mixture of eyeshadows. It had some bronzers, a highlighter, as well as a blush. And the colors just spoke to me. So. If I don't end up getting it, I'm hoping, and if you also moved up to Icon uh, this month, like so many of us do, that it will be available in our add-ons so that so many of us who maybe wanted that at a really discounted price will be able to get it. But what I ended up getting was another beautiful, beautiful palette and a huge palette from uh, Iconic. This is Iconic London, and I have so many of these palettes and I have to store them in another area because they are so large. This is the Treat Yourself Eyeshadow Palette. And through the comments, a lot of people were mentioning that they felt last month, the palette or the shades, just like in the glam bag, a lot of them, they felt, oh, didn't scream summer. Well, if you end up with this palette, it definitely screams summer. There is a full, beautiful mirror in it. And then we have these gorgeous shades here that are uh, in this palette. And the names in here are just fantastic. It's Cotton Candy, Glazed Donut, Candy Queen, Blueberry Sucker, all of those here. So I'm gonna do my best to bring them up here so you guys can see them. And we will definitely do a quick swatch on everything so you'll be able to see. But for me, the consistency of uh, the Iconic London, I have been very lucky with. I find they are beautiful and they uh, definitely stay with uh, primer and without primer. So I'm gonna do the top row those are the four shades there. And for pastel, pastel type of colors, these I thought had a lot more color than I was anticipating. But this is, I know what so many people were hoping for, and I think it is really, really pretty. So I'm gonna have the wet cloth right beside me and my dry cloth right after, so that we can try to get the colors not to mingle with each other just on the swatches and they feel very soft to the touch the mattes feel just as soft as the satin shimmers and we'll do it right underneath that matte is just stunning and then those are those shades there okay Definitely seeing pigment and definitely feeling like they are swatching just beautifully. 
I'm doing my best quickly to try to get all of this swatched for you guys because like I said, if it's a decision you're gonna be making, and be it if it's choice or add-ons, I want you guys to have as much information before choice day. And they seem to be swatching really, really beautiful. And then we just have one more row. And then those are those. And that is the whole palette. So you're definitely getting, if you're a pastel lover, this is amazing. But I also think you'll be able to use this, you know, going straight into fall. You got your perfect transition colors. You got your deep browns. You got your other transition colors here where you can darken up. And then if you want to go lighter, you have all those beautiful shades as well as what I like in the inner corner. And then the all over is just beautiful too. So really impressed with this. Thought it would, they did a really, really good job to give everybody what they were requesting, which was an eyeshadow palette. Let me see if I can get this here. Stand up, do I have enough room? Perfect, all right. So we're gonna do our best to keep everything in frame as much as we can. Excuse my arms. Okay, now we're already halfway there and we have the largest box to go through. So like I said, this is gonna be an informative video. It is gonna be long, but it's gonna be very detailed so that you guys will feel like you got the box at the same time that I did. All right, with the icon, and like I said, at the end, we're gonna do what the brochures and all the other sneak peeks as well. So in here, the first item that I pulled out was from Pathology. And this Pathology, is another brand that I absolutely love. And you know what's ironic is when I first got these type of eye patches, they weren't my favorite. And then I started getting eye patches in the, uh, you know, where you get one in a package. And I found that I wasn't using them as consistently because you had to like pull it open, open it up. So for travel, those individual packs were amazing. But by keeping these beside my bed when they come in jars like this, I found I was being way more consistent with my actual uh, using the product, which is amazing. So I'm very happy to have this and I'll be able to put this beside my bed. Also, if you wanna keep these, also you can put them in the refrigerator. If you wanna have a little bit more of a cooling effect, you can do that as well. And they're saying these are gel. And then this is the information that is on here. It comes with the spoon that helps you get the product out. And I'm gonna do this here like this, but I'm not gonna tilt it as much, but those are what they look like there. So they are very, usually these type of products, when you take them out, they can tear a little bit easier because they're thin. And a lot of times these might slide. I find for me, that's what ends up happening is that they will slide. But if I'm putting this on when I'm, you know, in my bed and it's the at the end of the night, I think this is, or fresh first thing in the morning is a nice way to use these as well. I'm very excited to get these and have the opportunity to try. And Pathology for me has been an amazing brand. The other one that is amazing is this from First Aid Beauty. This I share with you all the time is one that I get a lot of times in the travel packs in the 350 section. You get a set of 10 and it's really sealed so beautifully that even ones that I've had in my travel bag for when we were all stuck and we didn't travel for at least a couple of years. And then the first trip that I took, I ended up seeing them in my travel bag and I took them out. They were completely sealed, so I never used them yet. Were as if I just got them yesterday. So they are just fantastic. So once you use those, you'll know that these to have on your counter, you will love. And with First Aid Beauty, you do not have to worry if you have sensitive skin. Everything that I have used from this brand really has been amazing where you don't have to worry. And don't be afraid that it says in an exfoliator, everything is dermatology tested. There's never any artificial fragrances in their products. And like I said, it's tested for specifically sensitive skin. So I can use these dailies. I can use this even twice a day. They are just fantastic. There's 60 pads in here. They are, this is probably completely sealed. I didn't even open this up because I already have stuff open. This will be the size of like um, 
a little bit larger than a silver dollar. They are just fantastic. They're a really, really good size. They have like, you won't don't have to worry that your face is gonna get red from them or any irritation, but like any product you're gonna be trying, definitely use it because there is glycolic and lactic acids in here. Yet I found for me personally, it really ended up being a product and a brand that I trust and I'm able to use really, really well. All right, the next items that were in here, is from a brand that is newer to us, but one that I'm really impressed with. And this is the brand that's called L-I-T-H-E. Now, from my memory, based on the spoilers, I think this is a Canadian brand, and they were into lashes, I think, which is something that I don't gear towards. I'm more a mascara girl. But what I have tried from their brand so far has been an eyeliner that I fell in love with. It was a gel eyeliner that had a brush on the other side, and I was really impressed with that as well. So when this was in this PR package, I was excited because we definitely did a spoiler about this product and uh, this brand. And I am ecstatic now that I've had the opportunity to share these brushes with you because these are really, really well made. And you can tell the difference between an inexpensive brush and a good brush. And these are definitely good brushes. So this is the whole brushes that we get in here. I'm going to show you one at a time because they also have in here on here marked that this is going to be a crease defining brush. But like any brush, you can use them for whatever you want. But it has a really smooth touch to it. It has a nice weight to it. They came in like the perfect condition. They feel beautiful. As I'm pressing on it, even if I go close up or I go further down, which if you want, if you with eyeshadow, if you wanted to have a lighter, you use it further down, you want it to be more dense, you can also, you know, put it closer to the barrel but they're not flaring out, which is what I don't like about a lot of brushes. And these feel very, very high end. So that is the first one here. This one's a really unique one. And on this one is called the Flawless Concealer Brush. And so many of us have been influenced by the paw brushes, which I think are great. But this type of brush is also really, really good. So this I've used in the past brushes similar to this, where you can put your concealer down and then on the other side, you can use it to place the powder right on top. It is made beautifully. It is a really unique brush. Very excited about this. Like I said, very soft to the touch, has a firmness to it, but a softness at the same time, which to me is a really, really good brush. The next one that is in here is one that is from the Essential Blending Brush. And then this one is here. And if you want to see the difference between the two side by side, you can see here that one is fluffier and one is thinner. And then the other one that looks like a blending brush is this one here. And this is the Precision Shadow Brush. And then that has more of a flat surface to it. And again, they all feel absolutely, absolutely fantastic. And then we have here, this should be the pencil brush. Yeah, this is a pencil crease brush. And then these I always, when I showed you in the Get Readies With Me, is what I use on every one of my makeups. This is great for under the eyes to give that line, but I also use this to pick up the darker shades because it picks up just a little. And then I will use a blet to place. That's what I do at where you get that outer V or outer C. And then I'll use the blending brush to blend it out. Then here we have the one that is the Glow Highlighter Brush, and this is stunning. And this is to me just as beautiful as ones that I've gotten from Alomar as well as some other high-end brands. So very excited about this too. And as you can see here, this has more give to it, which is what a highlighter brush should have. So really, really excited about that. So happy because this definitely, if it was a choice for me, I would have chosen because I wanted to try more from that brand because it just, I was impressed by it. This one was one that I'm not that familiar with. It is from this brand that's called Femme UE, and this is a brilliant cleansing gel. It's a gentle facial wash. Here it says Flower Energy. This is how to use it. And there's some of the ingredients. And then it says it's dermatology tested. And then here is, it's in another language. So this is a full, beautiful box. It feels almost like a linen box, which is a really nice high end. And then this one here is what it looks like here. So it says it's a brilliant cleansing gel, facial wash. This is 100 mils in here, which is just over three ounces. And I don't know how much this will pick up. I'm always surprised when I watch it back with you guys, how much gets picked up by the camera. I already took out the safety seal, so we'll be able to see what the product looks like. So it did mention that it was going to be a gel cleanser. So there's no surprises over there. And then that is what it looks like here. 
it also has just a really fresh uh, scent to it a little flowery yeah definitely has more of a flowery scent we'll definitely have to look at the ingredients there but i will definitely try to rub it so you guys will be able to see the consistency of the cleanser so that is that that looks like there but to me that has like a really almost like an, a bit of a like flowery but earthy at the same time very unique scent all right the next item that we got in here was from Fenty Skin. And this also is a brand that I absolutely adore. Everything that I have tried has been a win for me from their skincare brand, which is Fenty Skin or their makeup brand. And I even was able to get the edit box, which I love uh, all the products that I got in there. And this is called Watch A Tone. And this is a niacinamide. They're saying it is a dark spot treatment. And then here is some of the information on the back of the carton. It's saying to hit the spot for brightening all over, reduce the look of dark spots and even your skin tone. So excited about this. And then this is what this product looks like here. There's some information on the back here that I don't know how much we'll be able to see. When you open it up, there was no safety seal, but this is what it looked like here. And I'll just pour a little bit. Okay. How you get this product out, I did not know because I didn't open this prior to. This comes completely all together. You'll see the FS on the top of here, which it is the name Fenty Skin. I tried tipping it over and nothing came out, as you can see here. But if you press the bottom, it comes out. So this is perfect if you want to do those spot treatments because I do have one spot definitely getting more of them because if you were like me when you were younger you enjoyed that sunshine and uh, the sun protections that are available today uh, were not available or we just didn't use them <laughs> when we were younger but this is fantastic because you'll be able to use this as a spot treatment but as you can see one little dot goes a really really long way so this will be fantastic to hopefully spot treatment but also use all over the face as well. So that is a really unique component on how you get the product out. So excited about that. The next item that we got, let me just try to wipe a little bit here. We got from Kat Von D. This is a product that I have in my stash. This is a pore refining primer. This is also a really fantastic brand and product. And KVD was initially um, work working with a Kat Von D, which is where the KVD originated from. And uh, then when she no longer was part of the brand, they kept the name KVD, but they had it stand for different things like vegan and things like that. But the same company that was making her products are, is still involved. That's the brand that's called Kendo. And I really, really enjoy the brand's products. So I was happy that uh, we are still using the products from the same manufacturer. So this is what this is here. And if you've never used this, this is also, I I didn't open this, I apologize, I should have brought mine down here. This has a really nice lotion-y effect to it. It is really, really pretty. It's a really, really good product. The next brand that we got in here was from Kosas. This is the Weightless Lip Color. This is what the shade is that they sent over in the PR package. And it says it's a warm, uh, from what I can see here, rosy pink. But I think based on this sticker, it has more of the color that I really enjoy, which is the um, more peachy tone, but we'll swatch it and we'll see. This component is beautiful. It's a square. It has also a magnetic to it. When you open it up, that is the shade here. And then we'll just do a little swatch here. So it has a real creamy texture to it. Really went on beautifully. Love that it has a magnetic closure. And then that is what it looks like there. Really, really pretty. And then finally, the last product here is one that I'm not gonna be swatching because I've had this in the past a couple of times and it is one that I even gave away in some giveaways. This is from Iconic London. This is a multi-use cream blush. There is a bronze, a highlighter in here. And then this is what it looks like here and the information on the back of the carton. The actual product is a full mirror uh, on the front as well as inside. So I'm just gonna do my best to show you what these cream products look like up close. So we have the highlighter, a couple of blushes. 
you have your, um, to me this is like a concealer color, your bronzer color, and a deeper bronzer as well. And these I felt were easy to work with. They were really a beautiful consistency. And uh, one, like I mentioned, for me personally, is one that uh, I, I think I decluttered as well as um, gave away as also, but that's because I'm also, at that time, was really not into blush creamy products, but more and more that I had the opportunity to try cream products, I'm getting a little bit better and I'm starting to enjoy them a little bit more. So maybe in the future, I will pull this out and uh, use it. But until I make that decision, I didn't want to swatch anything in case it ends up in a giveaway. So I wanted to definitely share with you some of the information that is in some of these brochures. And then we'll be able to have some sneak peeks for September as well. So if you're still with me, make sure to, you know, thumbs up and leave in the comments. Stayed with you till the end. All right. Some of these items here are fantastic that was on this card was that we're going to have two limited edition mystery bags, which we have every month. The price went up, I think, by a couple of dollars based on my last time looking and sharing with you about these mysteries. But what's good to know is there is a date on here. So I want to make sure to put that up to the camera. And then, of course, you'll have the one that's the smaller one, which will be the one that's probably going to be $16. And then the larger one that will be all full-size products will be probably $34, just based on the in the past. And they're saying this will start on the 12th. The other information that is on the card is this here. They're calling it the Beauty Olympics. So who's watching? I'm really enjoying the gymnastics. That has been mind-blowing to me. And then here is some of the beautiful information on some of the products here that we'll be able to see this month as well. The other brochure that we got in was here. And on this one, the information on the card is just about metallic makeup, gold liners, silver gloss, and then bronzy cut crease. And then the other information on the back here is just telling you about the icon box that is eight a full sizes worth up to $350, $60 a quarter. The Boxy Charm has five full size products where you get to choose three. You still get to choose three in the icon box as well. And it's worth up to $200 with $30 a month. And then the Glam Bag, which is the five deluxe beauty samples. You get to choose one worth up to $70 for the $14 a month. The other brochure that was in here was from the icon. And this was really more about uh, just through a quick glance, was about uh, Chrissy and John. And then they also sent over, which I've had in the frame here since the beginning, and I apologize, I forgot this about this completely. This was in the bottom of the box because all these three boxes get shipped together for PR. So this is more products that I think, especially this one, we know is the new brand by John Legend. And this is the brand that he is going, they mentioned is not gonna be in our choices based on the information that they sent over that we were able to read about, you know, during the during the uh, spoilers. They're saying this is gonna be in the add-on. So if you're interested in his line, the only sneak peek they shared was going to be some um, wipes. But this here is gonna be the Rose Hip and C Buck Thorn oils, deeply moisturized natural bamboo, gently exfoliates, cleanses, and aloe vera to calm. And his brand is called Loved One. And this is going to be an exfoliating cleanser. So I will definitely swatch this for you guys as well. And then this is the information that is on the back of the packaging here. And here it tells you that it's made in the USA and it is vegan, cruelty-free. Um, but it says it's also made with PCR content so i don't know what that would mean what the difference is so if you guys do know make sure to share it uh, in the comments down below and again i took off the safety seal for this so that we'll be able to test all the products yeah this is an exfoliator the um exfoliation is really really minor it feels almost like a little bit thicker than like a salt Let's see if i can get it so that i can rub it and you guys will be able to see the consistency of the actual exfoliation. And there you go. So it feels more like a salt, like in between a salt and, and not as thick as a sugar, but not as thin as a salt either. So it is definitely exfoliator. So that is what that looks like here. And again, the scent is to me very herbal. If that's a scent that I can share, that's what it smells like to me. 
So that is that product. And the other goodies that were put in here, and I think this is really uh, for PR to, to give us the opportunity to know that there is a brand that she's also created because this is by Chrissy Teigen. It's Cravings. She used to have a cooking show, and I think now she has another one that is also streaming. Uh, I also know that she worked also with, uh, I think it was uh, the mother of the Kardashians, uh, Chris. Uh, she did also some cleaning formulas with her as well. So very entrepreneurial. And this is going to be a chocolate chunk cookie mix. Um, I don't know the last time that I made cookies like this. A lot of times I get the ones that are, uh, you just have to pop them in the oven. But uh, definitely excited to have the opportunity to try something from her brand. And then this here is, uh, like I mentioned, they were the creators, uh, the collaborators of this month's, um, which was a little unique because we're so used to brands that have products. So I wanted to make sure to share as much as I could. So it was, they did a lot of cute uh, promos. They also had some products that they're mentioning on the bottom here that we definitely shared already in the spoilers from By Row. It's the Black Cherry Lip Oil, the uh, Commodity Fragrance, the Juice One, then JLo Beauty, Living Proof, Moon Aura, which is the Kendall Jenner line. Pathology we had in this box, Drunk Elephant, I did not see, but it looks like they're gonna have the Scalp Scrub, which I've gotten in the past, it's really good. And then the Femu, which they're saying that here we have in this box is a $32 value. It says, the minute I'm home from an event, she washes her face, she loves being fresh face, she feels so much more confident in her own skin. And then she just shares some really cute She's very into cooking and all of that. So that's that's on that page. Then here is the recipe for Glam. There's some of the products that we had the opportunity to share here. Definitely am interested in the Dry Bar. Definitely interested in the El Maquillage Master Palette. But we did get to try one of the Cosas, Cosas products, the lip products. So that's going to be in a few different colors, it looks like. And that beautiful brush set as well. So I think that is fantastic. And then they had on the bottom here, there's also from Give Beauty. There's gonna be the um, Sculpting Eyebrow Pencil, Iconic London, the Multi-Use Cream, which is what we have here, a Bronzer Highlighter Palette. They also have from Too Faced, the Better Than Six Mascara, the Dry Bar, the Il Maquillage Master, as I mentioned. Uh, what else is here? The brush set is $48. There's also from Danessa Merrix. There's going to be a Paint Brush Fluid Liner that's gonna have a, a value of $18. And then here's a cute picture of John Legend. And then inside here, the loving couple. And then here are some more products that we had the opportunity to also use in the spoilers, where it's fantastic product from Kate Berkey, the KVD we went through here, Morphe setting spray. We're very excited that that is now part of the Ipsy uh, choices. Very excited about that one. The Pat McGrath, the Janessa Merricks, a lot of us are very excited about. Uh, the Makeup Forever, excited about the Glowish. So there's a lot this time around that I definitely uh, passed on the Trend Mood box uh, that I'm going to use those dollars. Hopefully, uh, if I need to, I'll have it to be able to get some treats that we have coming up here. So that's all the information that was in this brochure. Now in the BoxyCharm brochure is the one that has, whoops, has some more of the information here. This is the Beauty Olympics, as you can see here. There are some of the spoilers. Lunar Beauty, we went through. That one is going to be a beautiful blush. That's his newest launch. Uh, in Beauty, this cleanser, I'm currently put it into my shower. So I'm just starting to use that. The Buxom, I'm excited about that product too. That's something that I've used in the past. I'm very excited to have the opportunity to get it again. Then I mentioned to you that Keys Beauty is going to have one of those skin tints. So I'm excited about that one. Amika, another one that I'm hoping will be in my boxes. And then this Everden, I'm not that familiar with that brand, but that would be a newer one. And that's a facial cleanser. There they're mentioning again the uh, what we just showed on the other brochure for the mysteries. And then here we have Add to Cart. So they're going to definitely have this time around. So if you missed out on the uh, Wonder Beauty Wonderlust Powder Foundation, that was a find. And it looks like it's only going to be $12. So maybe this is going to be a smaller size because that one I'm really impressed with. Laura Geller, I'd never tried their mascara. So that is only $12 as well. And then the Buxom Full uh, on Plumping Lip Matte, uh, they're saying in the beach is the shade that they're showing there. Also, they're saying that's going to be $17. And then on the back here is what's the exciting part. 
Down here, if you're interested in the Christy Teigen, they have this code here that is charming25 for 25% off her brand, which is called Cravings. So if you're interested in that, you'll be able to get it for yourself at 25% off, which I think is really nice for them to do. And then we have some of the spoilers for September. So we have here this first one, which is a newer brand to me. So again, please share in the comments from Olivia Uma. They're saying that's a glass skin. They're saying it is going to be a cleanser. The next one is from Dry Bar. That's going to be a triple sec three in one texturing finishing spray. Then again, we're going to have from Il Maquillage the mineral, but it's going to be their big blushes, which are some of my favorites. So excited about that. We also have from Misho Beauty. This is going to be their contour stick. From uh, Dermalect, we're going to have their Repair Barrier Balancing Serum. And then at the end from Girlactic, we're going to get a Rose Petal Dewy Face Mist. So again, we're not sure what these are. It simply says on the back of here, uh, September Choice Lineup. So they're saying we'll be able to choose three from this and that will all happen in September 1st through the 3rd. So these are just a sneak peek of some of our choices for September. So like I said, very excited for this month and very excited to have the opportunity to have this channel where I can sit down and really share with you in detail about the products that you'll have the opportunity, hopefully not only to receive, but to choose as well. So don't forget to share in the comments because like I mentioned, this is my lifeline to you guys. I will definitely, well, you hopefully will have seen this, but I will definitely post uh, in the community tab, which you will have access to as long as you are subscribed to this channel. And like I mentioned, to subscribe here is free. So you'll be able Able to get a lot of the information that I share over on my Instagram I do my best with certain posts that I do especially informative ones like this that something's arrived that I want to share with you I will try to put that in the community tab as well so that you guys will know that this was gonna go up at midnight so we stay within the rules so it will hit you guys on the first of the month but it will still be before choice however this did come late in the day on the 31st so it wasn't like I was holding back any information I just had the time to really sit back and film for a good period of time to be able to share with you every detail not only of what we have possibility in our choices but also in what is coming our way in September as well. So if you enjoy these type of informative videos, make sure you're subscribed. Make sure to share this channel because I'm not on Facebook or any others. I will definitely share at one point a, a video of why I've chosen to film more this way than uh, with my face. But I have for three and a half years was on camera every single day, uh, full makeup, full dress, full everything. But I will definitely take the time to share that with you because a lot of things happened that pushed me to start filming this way. And I ended up finding that it was becoming more information about the products and now trying to do a few get ready with me so we get to play with the products as opposed to just unboxing on camera. And I hope you're enjoying this type of format. And like I said, make sure to share in the comments because that's my lifeline to you guys. Otherwise, I'm just sitting alone in a room sharing this information to a camera. All right, so take care everybody. Make sure to share that you watched in full. And if you did, simply say ready for August. And I will see you all soon in the next video. Take care everybody and continue to stay safe and well. Bye for now.